ein herzliches Hallo von mir an euch. Willkommen zurück zu einer weiteren Folge Hellblade 10 Uhr Sacrifice. Ja, wir gehen jetzt mal schauen, was diese, dieses blaue Licht da hinten ist, würde ich sagen. Ähm, so. Los geht's. Nee, wir gehen erstmal hier gucken. Ja. Äh, äh, aber auch noch nicht. Vielleicht. Ah, guck mal da hinten. Richtigen Riecher gehabt. Hier ist nämlich noch. Oh, was ist das? Da hinten ist nämlich noch eine, eine Rune. Und dann gehen wir hier gucken. Hier ist noch so ein Ding. As Sigmund and Sinfjotli are being buried alive, Sigmund's sister throws an armful of straw into the grave mound. Hidden in the straw is Sigmund's sword, the gift of Odin. They cut their way out of the grave mound and set fire to Sigir's hall. The king burns to death. Sigmund calls to his sister to come out, so that she may live and be honored. She does come out, but only to tell him the truth. That she had slept with him, her brother, to beget a strong avenger. I am not fit to live, she says, and walks back into the fire. Strike vengeance from your heart, Senua, as there is always a heavy price to pay. Hinten sehe ich noch eine Rune. Wartet, aber was ist das hier? Okay. Entweder können wir hier noch nichts machen oder wir können hier generell nichts machen. Ich weiß auch nicht, ob es gut ist, dass ich jetzt erst hier unten rumlaufe und nicht da oben zu dem, Rot äh, zu dem blauen Licht. Wir gucken mal. Und hier ist das Ende von Sigmunds Story. Er war ein fierce und großer Warrior, der viele Kämpfe gemacht hat. One day, an old man came onto the battlefield. Although shadowed by a hood, Sigmund saw that he only had one eye. The man raised his spear, and Sigmund struck at it with his sword, but the sword shattered into pieces. Sigmund then knew that this was Odin, and thus that victory could not be his. He bowed his head and accepted his end. Dying, He tells his wife that she is with child, and that her son will one day make a great weapon out of the fragments of his sword. The sword named Gram. Hier ist auch, also es gibt drei von diesen Dingern hier. Was auch immer das ist. Ah, wir hätten hier sowieso rumgemusst. Oh. Cool. Ich bin einfach direkt den richtigen Weg gelaufen.
What's happening? Senua, imagine a sword that can slay gods. <laughs> its name is Gramr. It was forged by the god of all Northmen, Odin, and gifted to Sigmund, a great warrior. I need this sword. It's important. Can you help me? The sword appears whole, but it is an illusion. It shattered into shards long ago. It is said a great warrior can reforge Gramr by answering the trials of Odin, one for each shard. The roots of the Tree of Death will take you to new lands where you will face the trials. Go to the shards. Go to the shard. Go to the shards. What's the shard? Okay. Find it. Jetzt the metal wissen wir. It's in front of you. Find it. The metal. The runes. Ja, hier komme ich nicht durch. Ich muss wieder außen rum. Ist das jetzt egal, in welcher Reihenfolge ich das mache? Find it. There it is. Focus. A king in the north forced the dwarves to make a sword that would never fail and never rust, and that would slice through iron and stone and bring victory to its bearer. But the angry dwarves cursed it. It would be the death of a man every time it was drawn, and it would be the death of the king. Let me tell you about the sword Tyrving. I don't recognize this place. Where are we? Where is she? It feels wrong. Where are we now? Okay, it's a card burial. One is collect. It's so strange that we go to such lengths to bury death. Something so very ordinary. Inevitable. It's as if we conspire to hide death. Because we have no answer for it. But when it comes and forces itself onto our friends or loved ones, then comes the reckoning. You can feel the death. Senua, you remind me of a story that the Northmen tell about a young woman warrior. Her name is Herver, the daughter of a berserker born after he was killed. She's a wild, willful child who teaches herself to fight with weapons. When she learns where her father is buried, her only desire is to reclaim the treasure buried with him, but above all, the sword, Tyrving. The Boden hat sich hier gerade bewegt. Habt ihr das gesehen? Hui. Ja, irgendwie, mein PC kriegt das Spiel nicht so ganz gebacken. Ich weiß auch nicht. Aber ist das Spiel eigentlich jetzt nicht so ressourcenzehrend wie andere Spiele, die ich so spiele? Aber irgendwie, mein PC und das Spiel vertragen es sich nicht. Warum das also ich, ich fange gerade mit dieser Folge eine neue Aufnahmesession an. Warum das halt so hakt? Dillian, I'm here. I'm here for the trials. Like when we first met, remember? I'll find him. Nothing. Was that voices? Is that his voice? 
walls are the voices of the dead. Not Dillian. Dillian's calling to Don't you. Don't touch the walls. You don't know what they might do. Turn back. She has to keep going. It's not safe here. She has this to was keep super going. going. If you go down there, no one can save you. It's too ah, scary. here is wieder der Schild mit dem gelben Strich. Warte, was war hier? Kann hier drin nicht rennen. Ist gar kein Zeichen. Oh, gut, dass wir hier noch mal gucken waren. Herver disguises herself as a man to join a band of warriors and soon becomes their leader. When they come to the island where her father is buried, her men do not want to go ashore. They say that evil haunts the island, and that it is a worse place by day than other places are by night. Fearless, she lands alone. There are many grave mounds, and all of them have ghostly flames burning over them. She comes to the grave mound of her father after passing through these ghostly fires as though they were mist. I can hear him. Was das hier auf dem Boden? Within the burial mound, Herver calls on her father to wake from death and bring her his sword. She says that it is not seemly for the dead in their grave mounds to bear valuable weapons. Her father answers with words of warning. You go to your doom. Baleful runes surround you. You have gone mad. You have lost your mind. Your thoughts are confused. It is dangerous to wake the dead. Like I said, she reminds me of you. <laughs> okay, bin ich hier richtig? Dann gehe ich hier noch mal in die andere Richtung. Ich würde gerne die Runensteine alle mitnehmen. Und ich denke, die sind hier alle versteckt irgendwie. Hier ist wieder das gleiche Symbol jetzt. Oh, äh, sorry, musste kurz Pause machen. Handy hat geklingelt. Okay, wir müssen immer den Weg gehen, wo nicht das gleiche Schild auftaucht. Ja, quasi wieder hier wie ganz am Anfang. Da war auf dem Schild auch nichts drauf. Wie können wir durch? Ist das der richtige Weg? Ich würde gern schneller laufen können hier drin. Geht nicht. Okay, wartet. Na, ja, aber ich weiß nicht. Ich möchte gerne alle Runsteine mitnehmen. Das ist nicht er, es kann nicht sein. Das ist nicht Dillian. Das ist nicht Dillian. Das ist nicht Dillian. 
Hervor ignores her father's warnings. The grave mound opens, and it seems to be full of fire. Again, Hervor demands her inheritance, but her father warns her that the sword is cursed and would be the bane of her family. But he relents and brings her the sword. She leaves the island with it, but the curse holds true, and death would follow in the years to come. And so, so the misdeeds of her father have become the curse. Okay, what's awaited us yet? Und geht weiter. Oh, hier ist Feuer. Jetzt nicht weiter. Dann müssen wir jetzt wohl hier rein. I'm leaving. I've decided. I think it will be good for me. It's the darkness. It's speaking through. No, Dad, it's me. I think I can beat it. In my own way. I can see the darkness in your eyes, child. I met a boy. Boy. The chief and son. No. He said he could help me. It's a trick. He said it could be normal. Normal? Yes. No boy is going to save you. No one can. When they see the rot growing no. inside you, no. they will turn their back on you. The gods can only fix you through my hand. You're going nowhere. No. You will not defy the gods. Come, child, take my hand. Come, send one. I am leaving! You cannot escape the darkness. Your curse will make everyone suffer. You will have blood on your hands! Okay. It's done. You did it, but there's more. There's more. Good. Uh, Erste Prüfung geschafft, wie es ja da stand. Ähm, dann gehen wir direkt zur nächsten. Die war hier drüben. Äh, okay. Krass. Wir erfahren jetzt auf jeden Fall noch mehr über die Hintergründe von Senua. Hm.
mit dieser Prüfung hier machen wir aber morgen weiter. Denn die Zeit ist rum. Ähm, ich bin gespannt, was uns erwartet und wünsche euch jetzt aber erstmal noch einen schönen Tag. Und wir sehen uns sehr gern morgen wieder, wenn ihr möchtet. Ich ähm, freue mich auf euch. In diesem Sinne, macht's gut und bis morgen.